Easy Town Gaming. My name is Jonas. I'm your host, and I'm here with TNT Dynamite, the explosive one, Jonas. I'm the man on the X. Ooh, sticky boy. And we are playing a Monster Hunter World because I do declare that I get the vapors from the man. <laughs> you got the vapors from I the do. Monster Hunter. Oh, I forgot. Palpitation. Palpation. Palpitate. What is it? <laughs> Not palpation. Palpitations? What, no. My heart. I've got the. What do you. What are they? Come on. Think of what Southern Bell say, Jonas. You, I, I do declare that my. I don't know. That's that's not a Southern Bell. Th I don't know what you're talking about. I don't know Southern Bells, dude. We're in the South, but there are Bells here. You've lived in the South longer than me. Uh, have I? Uh, yeah. You're Florida's the South, too, bro. Yeah, we moved at the same time. <laughs> damn. <laughs> like literally, I think we moved to the south the same year. <laughs> I don't like it when you get me with logic. <laughs> I, I know that, that is the that is the one thing that happens sometimes. I hate that. <laughs> I don't like that at all. <laughs> <laughs> we are going to fight on this episode, Jones. We're going to fight a silver Rathalos. Ooh, he's one of the, that sounds exotic. He's one of the end game boys, and he is difficult. Oh, we're going to do a difficult thing, so we yeah. might die. We fought this boy on the last one. He was easy, though. Oh, uh, you was, ride him like sea biscuit. He was tempered. What do Southern Bells say? I do declare. Well, yeah, there's that. I got palpations. And then they call their papas or call them Big Daddy. I got the oh, sugar. Oh, my God, Big Daddy. I just think everything like the, what's that one girl from the Golden Girls? Blanche? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. The one that Deborah. didn't have gray hair? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, the one that was always getting with guys. Yeah, she was like, oh, I'm going to go see Walter tonight. What? It's always Walter. <laughs> it was always Walter. You made me play my instrument. It was <laughs> always Walter. <laughs> don't ever make me play my instrument. No. <laughs> I don't even know what that means. <laughs> <laughs> I promise I won't, oh, sir. Sorry. <laughs> this thing on my back is an instrument. It's a hunting horn. It's a, it's a musical oh, instrument. Oh, in the game. I thought you meant in real life. No, what? <laughs> I was like, what instrument I did mean, you just play? I could see your confusion. Yeah. <laughs> I want to... I need some shredded lettuce. I'll make fish tacos. What the, what the hell? Where the hell did that come from? <laughs> I'm hungry too. That's why. This is the last video, all right? I know, I know. I got you. We're going to get I your wanna, fish tacos. I want, I want, I don't know. I don't have any fish. I have chicken. I'll make that. What? Wait a minute. So why would you even bring up fish tacos? Because I'm going to make fish tacos. Do you have fish? Yes. Do you have lettuce? Maybe. So you don't even, you, you're basically... Don't have any of the ingredients. Wait, wait, lettuce might be the only one I don't have. Oh, you do have fish too? Yeah, I have fish. I, I just you're... said yes when you asked me. I heard no because it <laughs> You have fish? Me. Yes. Well, you don't even have fish. <laughs> I told you I went to Costco yesterday to get fish and it was a mistake. Oh. It was a grave mistake. Yeah, man. Traveling during, during Corona fever season is probably not the best idea. Yeah. I... <laughs> All right, I'm just going to go ahead and say this. I, I took one day, I think it was like last week after, you know, Corona was pretty much, it was, it was out there. People were talking about it. It was known. And uh, I went to a Chinese buffet. Ooh. And God, I want that so bad. This is so dude, good. It, it felt weird. It just felt. I wonder if we went to the Chinese buffet over here, if anybody would do that. That's what I was thinking, and there were there was there wasn't a lot of people there. It was early in the okay. day though, because I always like to go early when they when they first get the food out. There. Right, right, right. So you felt weird. Okay, I, I felt that. weird, and it wasn't because it was a Chinese buffet because that that's just me. I'm not that guy, but it just felt weird mainly being at a buffet during like a pandemic. But yeah, right. that's probably the one place you shouldn't be. <laughs> If there's anywhere you shouldn't be going, it is a buffet. I know, going to the buffet during a pandemic. Like, I feel weird about going to get food, period, at a restaurant right now. <laughs> like, right. anywhere. Like, if the chef's in the back coughing Corona all over my cheeseburger. Coughing Corona, just corona up your... <laughs> you get your cheeseburger with a side of Corona. And I feel bad because I want to support service industry people because they don't have insurance. They don't, they're, you know what I mean? Like, they're really hard affected by all this. Yeah. You know, but it's like, yeah. we're going to have all my stuff, so homie. So just make sure when you go to your fast food restaurant, you get the number seven, hold the Corona. Oh, my God. Can we go to Taco Bell and order something, hold the Corona, and see what happens? I just think that they would be offended. <laughs> <laughs> if I did that, <laughs> wouldn't they? Don't you think? 
Oh, dude, I'm sure. I'm pretty sure. I, I would not sure. eat it if I said that. I would just <laughs> order to hear the reaction. Yeah, just order something else to dollar. Right, yeah, I need uh, one uh, Frito burrito, hold the Corona. <laughs> and then, like, throw it in the trash immediately when they <laughs> hand it to me. It's illegal to mess with people's Oh, food, it's though. federal. Like, there's, oh, I, I don't know if I uh, told you this, but remember that video that went viral, that dude licking that Bluebell ice cream and putting it back in the freezer? Oh, yeah, he's he, going time. Yeah, he got, like, what was it, like a year or 30 days or something? He got, he went to, he's going to jail. Yeah, longer than Aunt Becky is, that's Yeah, for sure. yeah. And it's like, yeah, you can't, it's like super illegal to like, it's like to spit in the lick or whatever somebody's food. Like, I mean, and rightfully so, it's oh. disgusting. Oh, absolutely. Are you serious? Well, don't, it's, it's don't, funny because I don't think people don't, realize. I'm dead? Oh, no. Oh, I'm alive. I don't think people <laughs> realize that because, like, you know, people will be like, oh, ha ha, we'll spit in this, the, the guy's fooks are being an a-hole. Like, but yeah, you could go to jail for that. <laughs> you 100% like, can. Yeah, like you absolutely. It's illegal. Mm -hmm. Yeah, man. Sorry, I almost died there. It no. should be illegal to pee on the floor of a public restroom, too. <laughs> like, you go to the bar, and at the end of the night, they're like, the men's room just has pee all over the floor because dudes are trash. I'm sorry, I thought this was America. <laughs> well, then why can't you lick somebody's food? Peeing on the I mean, nobody has to eat the, the floor but where I'm get, peeing. I gotta get pee on my shoes and take it in my house. You're walking on them! I'm just gonna start taking up for the for the floor pissers You're of America. The devil's advocate side of the guy who just pees on the floor. I'm like, but dude, I mean, come on, it's a it's a small bowl. I mean, <laughs> <laughs> I'll take that stand. Yeah, yeah. It uh, nah, dude. It's just I get it. It's just I don't know. I think that I would rather somebody pee on the floor and me walk through it with my shoes on and just be, you know, mildly inconvenient inconvenience than ingest somebody else's saliva. Oh, I a thousand percent. I agree. I would if that's my choices. Cool. I'd rather have neither. <laughs> yeah, those are your choices. I'd rather have neither, but yes, I, I will take the no spit in my food thing. Yes, I would take I have to take a few extra moments to clean my shoes. So do you think food that's deep fried right now is best for the corona? Well, Jonas, I'm not going to say that. Because, <laughs> like, it kills off. You think, well, if, if like, Good. I cough corona on some raw chicken wings and then I deep fry them, am I safe? I mean, yeah. I mean, it, it kills E. coli, for, for God's sake, so I hope it could cure corona. <laughs> but, I mean, if you cook anything at long enough at a high enough temp, right? Isn't that the whole point? Yeah, I think that's kind of yeah. I think that's kind so of. So with that being said, you should just boil everything. But, the, but then they take it out of the out of the thing when they sauce it up. They re cough on it and then it's fresh right on top. Yeah. So just boil everything, you know. Just <laughs> Get my fried chicken wings and bring them home and boil them. Yeah. Just <laughs> boil your boil all your chickens from now on. Ugh. <laughs> Boiled chicken is the worst. <laughs> right. Unless you're making chicken soup, that's the only time it because then it's gonna be in water anyway. Yeah, dude. Oh my god, it's so gross. <laughs> boiled chicken. It's like boiled hot dogs. Ugh. Well, you know, I used to eat boiled hot dogs. I used to eat boiled hot dogs too, but now I don't know if I would. They get all plumped up. <laughs> they get all full of water. They plump when you cook them. They ew. I got something else <laughs> getting plump when it cooks. Tiny's off. Don't. You know, you're making a penis. <laughs> Whoa, why you gotta be the D guy? It's the first time we talked about D's in all these videos today. You know I'm that? proud of us, yeah. actually. Yeah, we're, we're, I was, actually, I was surprised. Normally it comes up. It, it only, oh, wait, no, you talked about him earlier. Because you said don't talk about your T, I can talk about your D. So you did. Oh, uh, yeah! Illusion, no. I mean. You said you were gonna wrap up the wrinkles and force it in there. That's, like, that's not a D joke. I could have taken those wrinkles from anywhere. <laughs> There. It could have been anywhere. Put a rubber band around that thing. <laughs> could have just like took some elbow foreskin. Oh, is some it? funny bone coverage. <laughs> is, it, is it foreskin if it's on your elbow? I don't know. It's, I don't know. But yeah, I guess. Skin before. Well. You threw me off track now, Josh. I had something else. We were talking about eating food at restaurants. Yeah, so yeah, I could see feeling weird about eating food at restaurants right now. A hundred percent. And it sucks because, like, I feel, I, I, you know what I mean? I feel like those are the people that we should be supporting. I did, did see some things online that kind of, I don't know, I, like, I get, but, like, they were like, don't oh forget God, about your dude. service personnel and try to tip them extra because they're struggling right now. Why are they struggling? 
because they're, they're not. Oh, because there's less tips. Yeah, they're like try to tip them extra because they, are, you know, if they get sick, they aren't covered. Oh, yeah. yeah, you're not even wrong. What about like ordering stuff from like DoorDash or something? Right. Ugh, Jonas. Yeah. I don't want to get DoorDash now. Yeah. You could uh, Instacart and then you could just tell them to leave the groceries outside your door. I don't want to Instacart. That means somebody else just goes in and touches all over my bell pepper. Yep. And then you put it in the refrigerator and oh, it gets man. my chicken. This is, this is a tough time. <laughs> this is a tough time in the world when I don't want to have other people deliver my food for me. <laughs> Like that, problems, that has been my mo for so long. I don't. Oh my god, dude! Now I know how they felt during the Great Depression. Wow. Yeah. That's a bold statement. I I know now. It's, my eyes have been opened. Yeah. We have it really bad. Yeah, dude. I I don't want to order a pizza. That's a problem. No, Jonas Caronis. <laughs> No, Jonas Caron, he's very true. You make the best, most valid pizza. <laughs> I'll make my own pizza at home. I got pizza. That's what I'm saying, dude. You don't want to catch her. You don't want to catch her. <laughs> I don't know. I understand it's an irrational fear, and I, I'm kind of, I'm kind of like uh, playing it up a little bit. Oh, I know. Yeah, we always do that. But, but uh, it's, it's honestly, it, it is something that hit my mind when I walked into a Chinese buffet, and I was just like, yep. Yeah. Well, yeah. Here we go. I'll just, you're open to air everything. Yeah. Yep. The fashion by your hardworking and wonderfully uh, crafted Chinese fingers. Yeah. Am I allowed to say that? Uh, I don't know. Maybe. I try to precursor it with, uh, with compliments. Yeah. Does that I mean, make it okay? I think if you have to say, am I allowed to say that, that might tell you what you know. <laughs> Jonas. You are a freaking. I like you know you know what I like Jonas what? is that you're 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 just like equal enough parts white and not racist where you can call it out when you freaking see it in me, dude. And I love it. I love it, dude. Because. <laughs> what? What? No, I get it. I get it. Go on. I love it, man. <laughs> Because, like, I know how to call it out because I'm, like, I'm at the other end of the spectrum of line side. You know, I've been there. Right. Trust me. I've been there. But <laughs> I don't know. It's beautiful. <laughs> yeah, I'm just like, yeah, you know, you gotta ask yourself. <laughs> <laughs> it's, like it, it's like that's exactly what you would say to one of your brethren if they were... <laughs> I guess what I'd say right now. Oh, well, my dude. <laughs> you have to ask me if it's okay. Actually, it's probably not cool if you're taking it to that extent. <laughs> Anytime you have to say, is that racist? You've answered your own question. <laughs> that is probably the truest statement. <laughs> no. Am I, should I have said that? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, uh, that's funny. <laughs> God, this guy is taking all the hits. Dude, he is a this guy's a bastard, I'm telling you. But we had high enough levels in this group when I took the mission that I didn't think it would be this much of an epic issue. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't. I mean, am I pulling my weight 100%? No, because I keep getting poisoned, and I'm even out of poison stoppers. And I'm on fire, <laughs> and I'm stunned. <laughs> God, he's really... Uh, he is a jerk, man. He is a big jerk man boy. I hate big, him so bad, big dude. Big jerk man boy. Yeah, I that's... do. I hate him, dude. I usually don't have this much trouble. Now I have to play cautiously because I'm poisoned. Oh, uh, what's that? You slowly take your health down? Yeah. My health is the big bar that is glowing purple now because of the poison that is uh, taking over my... I've got the vapors. Dude, why would you come over here? I'm just trying to cut your tail open. And you want to... They cut his tail off. Man. Yeah, it's really kind of gruesome sometimes. There was like people who were like, "This game is, it's, it's uh, violence against animals." Oh, really? Yeah, dude. Could you come because here? Because you know that 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 dragon abuse is really uh really where it's at now. Oh, I mean, there are some some of these uh, creatures that are just like downright cute, though. I will have to say that. Oh, we got them. Yeah, oh, you did it. You won. Jeez. Oh my God! I didn't, didn't think it would happen, Jonas. I'd like to thank my mama and Jesus. Your mama and Jesus. Yeah, wow. Both of them. Cool. Thank you, Con Donald West and Kanye Trump. Con wow. 
<laughs> that is all the time we have for today's episode. Please make sure to like and subscribe. Why is Bruce Willis an American hero, Jonas? You've already done because of John McClane, dude. If you've already done that, make sure you subscribe again for Jonas. TNT. Catch you on the next one. We or. Oh,